That's fast. I've never seen you run that fast. Let's go, let's go. Stack my cones up. Zoe, you're so slow, you go faster. <laughs> ah, I like that. I like that. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Miriam. Like I always tell you, you're tall and you can't play basketball 10. You can't play basketball tall. It makes you weaker. So every time we do a drill and you do this, you take away your whole advantage at the game. So again, on the whistle, self pass, catch it on the hop and stay in triple threat with a wide base, all right? Good. Ladies. Throw it so you can stay behind the cone, all right? Take two steps behind your cone with your cone right in front of you, right in front of you. Look at your cone. Take two steps behind. Again, self fast. Good, all right? Behind. Behind. It's in the middle. Stop. Slide. Over. All right? First thing we're going to do here, we're going to work on our cross jab, all right? with the cone, protecting the ball and moving it from our hip and using our right leg to protect it as well. So it's gonna go here on the hop and then on my whistle, you're gonna cross strap here, all right? I want you to take the ball from your right hip, put it over top with your elbows out and put it to your left. Zoe, go stand on the sideline for me, all right? So it's gonna be here on the hop, your right foot, it's going to go to the left side of your cone, and you're going to take the ball from your right hip to your left hip. And I want you to move it and use your elbows, all right? I want you to create space, all right? Anybody that gets too close to you, I want you to have them think about it again. I want you to have them think about it a second time. You don't want people to crowd you. So it's going to be here, triple threat, ball here, here. And what are we always looking at? The basket, all right? Keena, you going to demonstrate for us? Everybody watch Keenan. Why are you looking at me? Good. And if I say retreat, you go right back. All right? You ready? Go. Good, good. Zorian, is that triple threat? No. Right foot to your left side of your cone. Go back. Good. I want you to rake the ball harder, all right? What you guys don't know is that the most aggressive basketball players in the UAE are the girls. They're really, really foul. They really push and everything. And so this is not going to cut it. Because if you're playing defense on me and the ball is like this, are you going to try to take it? Yeah. So I want you here. I want you bringing it up. Bringing it up. Because if you see my elbows like that, that gives you a little bit of, of fright, right? Because if I hit you in your nose, you'll be upset. So we want to be aggressive. Do it again. On the hop. Good. Yes. Let's see. Retreat. All right. First things first. I got to go over this with Farouk, but apparently you, Zorian, don't know your left and your right. Sorry, you either. All right. First things first, Farouk. Everything in basketball, everything that you hear about from us, starts with your feet, right? And that starts with your balance and your foundation. So for right now, when you start off, your feet are too close. Can't play defense like that. Can't play offense like that. You can't be athletic like that. So when we throw it here and we catch it in triple threat, I want a wide base. Everything is going to start from here with our knees bent, okay? Put your left hand in the air. Put your left hand in the air. You put your left hand in the air. All right, I want your right foot to go there. All right, so that means our left foot is our pivot foot. So Farouk, it'll be here. You catch it on balance here. 
You see how my feet are? Why? Knees bent. When I jab across, my right foot is going to move with the ball here. And I'm still wide, and my, my chin is on my shoulder. If I say retreat, you come back to your triple threat position, all right? When I blow the whistle, I want you guys to do it 10 times. So I want you to catch here, catch it on the hop, then go over, come back. That's one. Do it 10 times, all right? Ready? Go. Good, good. So come back here, all right? Stop drinking Starbucks before class, man. All right? So listen, hoop star shootout. All right, um, everybody on this team go turn white. All right, um, you guys go blue because you will play second against them. All right, so you guys have a seat over there. Yep. Yeah, you guys go have a seat, watch the first game. All right. That's it. All right, white team go with coach, blue team come with me, hurry up. All right, hey. Hey, circle up. Listen, remember this, no press, okay? But remember, we want to make sure we point and we say who we're guarding, right? Right? We want to keep our caboose to the baseline so we can see the whole floor, right? Right? And remember, when a shot goes, when some on the white team shoot, how many people rebound? Everybody, all five, right? We get it? Do we start dribbling right away? What do we do first? We catch it, then we look again. Yep, we catch with two hands, we turn, and we look, all right? And if we don't have the ball, where do we run? We do we run the down the middle or run wide? The yep. the other two go and we wide get and close to the basket down. for our layup, what do we do? Stop. Stop. And use the what? We use the back foot. All right, let's go, we're ready. Let's go, team on three, as loud as you can. One, two, three. Yeah. Oh, I said as loud as you can. All right. Team on three. One, two, three. Yeah. There we go. Let's go. You ain't, come on, you ain't got to stay in front of him. Right now, we're just going in half court, man to man. So take a good shot, make or miss, sprint back to half court, turn around, point to who you're guarding. All right, as you're sprinting back, let's make sure we got our hands high for deflections and make sure that no one's getting an easy layup down that way. 
okay? In transition the other way, we're running wide. You want to push the ball up the middle, right? Pass ahead. Let's try to get some easy ones to the basket. You guys got that? Let's go. Let's go, team on three. One, two, three. Get that next. shooter from the foul line all right so you guys have to huddle up as a team and pick your best shooter all right this is team basketball IQ pick the best shooter on your team yeah. <laughs> yeah. No pressure. all right Marley up first all right. You get one shot to survive. All right. Don't say a word. Nobody say a word. All right. All right, you got to make this one. All right. So, team two, you guys win. Comes down to pressure shots. You got to make them. All right, everybody have a seat right here. Listen up. Uh, sit a little closer. <clears throat> Getting you guys to understand that in the game, you have to be able to hear information, process it, all right, and apply it to the game, all right? And that's something that we have to get better at. You guys who haven't played that much on our, in Hoop Star Shootouts, some of the guys who played in our league games, all right, everybody has to do that. You, you don't just come consistently and get to a certain level and you just stop. Your growth in basketball continues on and on and on. Even to this day, I'm still learning something new every day. Okay, whether it be from old school or new school, I'm always learning. All right, so you have to keep working hard. You guys got that? All right, we're going to give out the awards because we, we're pressed for time. If I don't call your name, I call someone else's name, what do you do? Clap. Clap, all right. First up, let's give um, our awards to our tournament champs. All right, team two, Julieta, Karam, Zihang, Zach, Marley, Sam, Anabar, Simmons. Let's go. Clap it up for them. Let's go. Come on. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Good job, good job. Good job, good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. So you guys know the older group, right? I made a promise to you guys in like August. I said that I would get a pair of sneakers for whoever brought in the most people, right? You guys, none of you meet the deadline, right? I gave you guys a deadline. Nobody met the deadline, but Coach King and I, we always, always keep our word. So instead of letting you guys choose a pair of sneakers for whoever brought the most new people in, we decide to give 
a present to somebody who we're going to call the first ever Hoop Star Player of the Year. All right. This is something that you guys didn't know that we were looking at, but we always take account of everything that you do. All right. From the day that you join the academy, we give an expectation for on the court and off the court. That's character and classroom, character with your family, right? Character with the community. And then there's also your work ethic, work ethic on the gym and work ethic in the classroom, right? And so we always want to reward people who do the work when nobody's looking. And also they do the work when they might not win something all the time, right? And so for this year, our first ever Hoop Mountain Player of the Year is going to go to Felix. Felix. Come on, Felix. So, oh. And so, for Felix, all right, no, you guys are not getting a grilled pair of sneakers, all right? You didn't get that yet. But you can get a pair of Nikes right here. You open them up, check them out, you know? See what everybody get. All right, all right, all right. Three pairs, that's all you. Right. So, take a picture, Jeff.